Imagine a world where everything's connected just for you, where you can see a restaurant's menu at the blink of an eye, but also see how long it will take to be seated and how fresh the seafood is, where the air conditioning next to you is controlled by the sensors in your shirt and your car parks itself. The Internet of Things is most interesting when it's all about us, but that will require an ecosystem that lets IoT solutions talk to each other. For companies and organizations in all industries, IoT will drive a new business logic of co-creation and partnership. So what's an IoT ecosystem? In its simplest form, it starts with a device with a real-world use. A connected car. A connected house. A manufacturer learning how people use its products so they can build them better. Then there's intelligence. IoT isn't just about connecting machines to machines. It's about connecting machines to intelligence from controlling devices and small data to artificial intelligence and big data. And underlying it all is connectivity. The ecosystem is built on this. So one of the major drivers in the, in the thing is FOMO. But it's not just about connecting your industry or your business, it's actually finding new business models. I'll give you an example. If you have a water leakage in your home, that would automatically send a message to your plumber as well as to your insurance company. And it will all be sorted out without you even being there. Combining local businesses with global possibilities will require local ecosystems. In the Nordics and Baltics, we're in a unique situation. We have the most advanced connectivity infrastructure in the world, and we're early adopters. In the Nordics, we already have three connected devices for each person, and that's expected to double in the next five years. That's why Telia Company, together with Arthur D. Little, has created the Connected Things Report to see what's happening here in our region right now, and to better understand what it will take to build an IoT ecosystem for tomorrow.